what a community is. What a community is. Okay. So it gave us that definition of a community. Good. But then it talked more about something. It went a little more into detail about specifically what. What do you guys think? So it told us what a community was, but then it told us about, right? So remember each paragraph said, let's see, we've got bus drivers are part of the community and what they do, police officers and what they do, business people and what they do, parents and teachers and what they do, students and what they do, what you can do. <clears throat> so what was it mostly about then, would you say? Zelda put us on the right track. Let me give you a hint for this one. I'll just tell you so then you guys can help me with the next part. So it's this right here. People play different parts to make a community. So circle that sentence right there. People play different parts to make a community. Everyone needs to circle that sentence. Okay. And then it says, as you reread, underline key details that tell more about the main idea. So what are some key details that tell about how people play different parts to make a community? Somebody tell me one sentence that is a detail about that. A detail about people playing different parts to make a community. What kind of people did they tell us about? They told us about a lot. William, is that a hand up? Which one, William? For example, bus drivers help people to get to school or work. Perfect, good. Okay, that's one. What's another part they tell us about? Keep going where William was, that'll help you. Jesnor. Business people make or sell things that we buy. Okay, good. Business people make or sell things we buy. Perfect. Okay, there's one, two, three, four. Four more things we could underline. Zelda. Parents and children, parents and teachers make sure children have what they need to learn. Make sure children have what they need to learn and be fit. Perfect, good. Okay, there's one, two, three more people they talk about. Someone else tell me one. I'm gonna pick on somebody then. Let's do Aria. What's another person they talk about? There's two more in paragraph two and one in paragraph three. They talk about making sure people follow the laws and stay safe. Who does that? Um, police officers. Good. So police officers. Good. <clears throat> There's one more in paragraph two and one in paragraph three. Let's see. Raphael. Who else play a different part in the community? Yeah. You see, so we're looking for one more person in paragraph two that plays a different part in our community and one in paragraph three. What do you see? Mm. Yeah. Maybe right here. Students learn so they can be good parents and workers. Perfect, good, there's one. Thank you, Raphael. And then, Isaiah, who's it talking about in the third paragraph? In paragraph three, this one here. Who's the last part that plays a part in the community? Um, 
Do I read it? You can just tell me in paragraph three, who's it talking about? What's this word? Who's it talking about? Uh, you, me? Yeah. The, you guys, us, right? We all play an important part, okay? So you guys should have all those things underlined. Okay. I'll give you a minute to do that. And then we're gonna move to the next page. Page two. Or not two, sorry, page 27. Okay. So we, we did this part together, right? By underlining all that stuff. So the main idea was that people play different parts in the, to make a community. And if we were to pick three details, we could say police officers, make sure people follow the laws, parents and teachers make sure kids are safe and learning and bus drivers drive kids and parents to school, right? We did that already. So I'm not gonna have you guys write it, okay? Because we already did that. So now it is your job to do the next part. So like I said, um, we're gonna do it in groups again. And you guys in your groups, let me show you. In your group, you are reading page 28. Okay, reading page 28, doing page 29, and 31, okay? 